Hey Facebook, YouTube, what's up? This is Courtney Truman Steamers, January the 23rd. Just got to my second job in Snailville. Uh, both of my jobs were in Snailville. First customer was a repeat, uh, was a new customer. This customer was a repeat customer. I remember when they first moved in um, because of the setup of the house. When I pulled up, I would immediately remember the house. Uh, so I'm going to tell you a unique situation about these carpets. When the customer first moved to this house, these carpets were brand new. So I did not steam clean these carpets. I did an encapsulation cleaning. Um, with that being said, encapsulation cleaning isn't a rinsing method. Um, you're just encapsulating the carpet with a uh, certain cleaner. And as it dries, it crystallizes. And then you can pick up in the remaining soil with the vacuum cleaner. But again, it's not a superior cleaning like hot water extraction. So me being the professional, and this is the second time these carpets have been cleaned, I made the decision to hot, uh, hot water extract these carpets. I'm going to show you guys how big of a setup this is. Just got through finished setting up. So when I have jobs this big, um, I get all my hoses in first, get my corner guards put up, but I'll just go ahead and get all my hoses in. Uh, there's a total of six areas and the husband, Tony just told me that his wife wanted to, uh, scotch guard everything. So I'm going to also mix up some scotch guard and get the scotch guard prepared to put down on the carpets. <coughs> Excuse me. After the cleaning. So show you guys setting up. Um, and again, the carpets are in great condition. As you can see, you know, told me don't move any furniture, just go around. And like I said, this is a repeat customer. So the carpets are not bad. Um, actually, so you see the carpets are not bad at all. And what day was did I come out here? Uh, today is Wednesday. Uh, customer history, I can always see what day. So I was out here June 15th, 2017. Uh, so that's about a year and a half. Um, another thing, guys, for my cleaners, when you're doing stairs, you're having a lot of hose coming up. You know that the farther you go back to the stairs, your hoses are going to start trying to fall back down the stairs. And they can be very, very irritating. So you can go get these little hooks for less than five bucks. And these hooks are a lifesaver. Basically, keep your hoses from falling down the stairs so you got me a hook there and uh i used up all the corner guards i'm gonna do that rug just a synthetic rug on my corner guards corner guards and the customer was very impressed to see me put these up hey where did tony go uh he's probably in the other room okay all right, so I'm going to get everything. And I'm going to get the machine fired up. Yes. So, Tom, we're going to put Scotch Guard on everything, right? Yeah. Okay. All right, so I just want to make sure so I know how much to mix up. That's fine. All righty. All right, so. So, I'm probably going to mix up about two gallons of Scotch Guard and then also this rug right here. And then, of course, I got my sealer door put up. So you guys can see this is a pretty long run. Uh, 250 feet. This is a long run. Now, I will say I'm uh, very happy I got this machine. Because last time they used me, I had my old van. And the old unit was a lot smaller and uh, less powerful than this unit. So uh, my, my old unit was good for about 150 feet. Anything over 200 feet, it lost a lot of airflow. But with this machine right here, uh, 350, 400 feet, no problem. So you can see 200, 250 feet of hose uh, to clean this house. So I'm gonna do now, before I start, go ahead and get me some Scotch Guard made up uh, in my multi sprayer. So that's it, guys. So uh, some, some, some homes require larger um setups and other so like i said my first job was like a 50 feet run it was a little small townhouse and it was right there as soon as i pulled up the door is right there um and then this house was about four or five miles away 
and this is what this is what I get into here. So, uh, but it's good though. I'm very grateful. Uh, I'm very grateful that they did call me back and you know continue to use my services. So they let me know that I am doing something good. Actually, on my way here, I booked two jobs uh, for this week, and they both will repeat customers. So that's gonna do it. Thank you again, Courtney Truman Steamers. Go ahead and get started on this job, knock it out. See you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.